For more Magic the Gathering resources, check out my friends at paperchampion.net and Kitchen Table MTG. Hey everybody, we are playing Mono Blue Fairies today, and well, a one lander with all counter spells and a misbind click is probably not anything I can keep. This has got to be maybe like the exact opposite of the nut draw. So let's go mulligan that. Alright, well, we got the right mana, it's just a little bit slow, so but we can keep it. Uh, actually, we'll top that. Okay, so let's go. Turn one, Fairy Conclave. Okay, so. Okay. Oh, it's my opponent's turn. Okay, my opponent's on. I'm on the draw. Okay, that's actually works out okay for me. So I'm not too far behind on the curve. Okay. Alright, so we've got turn one, tap for Fairy Miscreant. Okay, go. Okay. We don't need to stop on our opponent's upkeep yet. Insolent Neonate, sure. Okay. Uh, turn to Ghost Quarter. Okay, so we will just swing in. Okay, going for one. Okay, and just hold up either Remand or Quickling, depending on what my opponent casts. Or maybe even Deprive. So they're gonna swing in. All right. We'll go quickly. Then we'll return our fairy miscreant to hand. Okay. Yes. Okay, and we will block with our two-two. Okay, and oh, it has mana reset. All right, well that's okay. Still, get that quickling in. All right, another insolent neonate. All right, so I don't want to play the fairy conclave just yet. Let's play fairy miscreant again. This time we can hold up vapor snag or remand. Okay, so just swing with quickling. Okay, so we'll see how we do here. Okay, so opponent, what do you have? Okay, so I have Remand against my opponent. Uh, Might of Old Crosa, huh? Well, we could always just Remand that. Okay. Okay, so they can swing for one. Um, we'll leave it. No. Okay, so if I get out a Fairy Lord here, that's going to be pretty sweet. So we'll go Fairy Conclave. And... Well, let's just... Well, do we just flash in Scion, or do we get in for extra here? If I get in for extra, I get in for an extra two. So I do five instead of three. Um... Hmm, hmm... Yeah, I think that I just hold it up here. I think I just swing for two. I know my opponent's going to try Might of Old Crosa again next turn. Alright, so... Um, actually, I can just hold up Spell Starter Sprite. Okay, so we'll just swing for three here. We'll just hold up Spell Starter Sprite. Okay. So opponent got greedy with their one lander. Man, I just did that. One land one getting stuck on a one lander just sucks. Alright, so opponent's gonna come in and swing. Okay, sure, I'll trade. Just go I'll let you have your two. They're gonna probably cast Might of Old Crosa. No. Okay. What are they doing now? Discard a card. Plus two minus. Okay, Ravenous Bloodseeker. Do I let them have that? It's a sack out. It's a discard outlet. Hmm. Hmm. Let's go Spell Stutter Sprite against that. Actually, no, I'll let them have it. I'll just get in my Scion of Una. 
Okay. Okay, so now I can hold up Spell Starter Sprite and Deprive. Okay, so we'll just swing with the crew here. So swing in for six. Okay, so looking pretty good. My opponent can maybe try and burn me, but I can also deprive Vapor Snag, Spell Starter Sprite. I can actually cast all three of the cards I have. So that's pretty good. Okay, so opponent, what do you have? A Might of Old Crosa? Okay. Okay. So they're going to swing in. Okay. I can't do anything. Are they going to declare block? Do anything on declare blockers? They've got priority. Oh, please discard some cards. All right. Please discard some cards. Okay. Okay, are they going to do anything else? Come on, discard more. Target creature, okay. Um, hmm. Do we just vapor snag it now? Um, okay, we'll just vapor snag it now. Okay, so my opponent loses, has just wasted a bunch of their spells, they discarded for nothing. Okay. And I'm swinging for lethal next turn. Sweet. Alright, that looks good. Let's go to sideboard. Okay, what else is going to work? Okay, so maybe spreading seas over deprive. Uh, I'm not sure about Echoing Truth. Um, yeah, let's just... We can submit this. Um, we'll run it like this and see how we do. Okay, so Madness Vampires. Okay. Red-green vampires, too. Alright. We'll see how we do. Okay, opponent. All right, so I got three lands, a miscreant, two miscreants, and a remand. All right, let's keep it. Okay, so I got turn one miscreant, turn two miscreant. Um, yeah, and draw a card. Okay. All right, so go. Island again. All right, so tap or miscreant. And go. All right, so turn two, get another miscreant, draw a card. I can also hold up Vapor Snag. Okay. All right. Okay, I'm maybe getting a little too many lands now. So we'll go another miscreant. Okay. Pestermite. All right. Pestermite's okay. We can stop on our opponent's upkeep and tap down their immolating soul eater. Is this a flying creature? Nope. All right. Well, we'll swing. All right. So, what does my opponent have here? Okay, anything, anything? Okay, so 
for holding up a vapor snag against my opponent, but next turn we can also Okay, we can also hold up a Pestermite. Deals three damage to target creature or player. Hmm. Do I really care about that? Not particularly. Still, it's irritating to lose it. Let's um I'll vapor snag my own here. Okay. Okay, we'll bring it back to my hand. Okay. So opponent can swing for one. All right, I'll take it. All right, unsummon. So let's go tap. We will play Fairy Miscreant again. Okay, draw a card. Quickling is very good. Okay, so we will just swing with Fairy Miscreant. All right, and go. Man, because quickly I will return the miscreant to my hand. Then I can cast it again and basically get another card draw out of it. Might of Old Crosa. Okay. Ouch. Okay. All right, well, we'll block with miscreant. Okay. Are they going to cast anything? Do they have any way to give it trample? It's plus one plus zero. Does, does it have trample? Uh, no. That's weird. Why would they do that? Okay. Sure. Okay. Might of Old Crosa. He has a dream. Maybe it's plus four, plus four. Okay. Weird. They have a way to give it trample. Teamir Battle Rage gains double strike. The end of turn. What? You just trample until end of turn if you control a creature with power four or greater. Ah, okay, so it's got trample. Okay, uh, well, we will just unsummon that. <laughs> oh, I feel like such a jerk. opponents tapped out they can't do anything it's so good uh. <laughs> oh oh this is the worst for my opponent oh it's so good I'm gonna stop on their upkeep okay we'll just swing for two <laughs> all right we'll swing for two and then tap all their lands on their upkeep <laughs> Opponents, uh, opponents being very good about it. Oh, man, it's just so bad. He's like, you just whooped up on my jank deck. <laughs> yes. Like, it's clever, but, you know, the fact that I can unsummon your creature just makes things really bad. Um, but I could have also remanded it, but just to unsummon it is just super bad for my opponent. Right, but these two fairies are just going to beat my opponent down. But really, they just beat themselves down like way more. Um, uh, <laughs> oh, I feel bad though. Uh, all right, opponent's being great about it though. I said, sorry, I had to cast that. Like, I just had it, so I had to cast it. And he's like, no need to be sorry. All right, they're giving me the GGs. All right, well, thanks, Mystical Brand. You're a good sport. I enjoyed playing you quite a bit. So, anyways, 
that's the match. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.